So, gentlemen, Nigeria 2, Sierra Long 1, goes from Alex Iwobi, Victor Osime, three points, job done at Abuja, we march on. Boys, you guys look dull, you guys look sad, <laughs> like main plane or something. What's going on? Huh? Let me start with my man right here. It's been a minute. Always a pleasure to be back on Tunnel TV. You know now, man. You know, obviously, I've been trying to recover from the disaster of, um, I don't know, what, two months ago. And you guys, uh, you know, unfortunately. Back to back disasters. Back to back disasters. Well, unfortunately, guys, you know, I'm back to reality. Nigeria is not going to the World Cup. Uh, come November, I'm going to, you know, have to choose a team to support. And unfortunately, watching this game now probably just shows me that perhaps that was the right decision not to go to the World Cup. Wow! <laughs> because I think I would probably have had, had my heart broken too early into the competition, right? Because what I've seen now is um, I haven't seen a team that is serious about playing good football. And what you play in the World Cup or at the World Cup is good football. And Nigeria, the Super Eagles haven't shown me that. I, I mean, I see some promises. It's not like we don't have the talent. We have the players. I think um, the job the coach has to do now is quite significant, right? And um, try to get them to play very well, the defense, from the defense to the attack, to the, um, to the midfield and to the attack. And for me, the standout players were obviously it will be and will see men. It will be for me, I've always said it, yeah. and I'm happy that there's consistency. I've told you that Iwobi is perhaps the, um, the best player in the Super Eagles. Hmm. Um, hey. Maybe um, uh, club-wise, <laughs> club you're making a lot of points now. Maybe yeah. club-wise, <laughs> maybe club-wise, he has not been at the level that he should be. But I think Iwobi is, a, is an extremely good player. He's gifted. He's technically gifted. Um, and uh, I just hope that uh, next season he begins to prove people wrong. I mean, listen to what Frank Lampard says about Iwobi. He says Iwobi, he's not sure Iwobi knows how good he is. You know, and he always says, and Frank Lampard says that, he says that to his own teammates, to his players, that you guys, and you know, that some of you guys don't know how good Iwobi is. And of course, Frank Lampard is proving this by playing Iwobi in the starting eleven. I, I think that's a vote of confidence. I knew, I knew you were going to have your little Iwobi. He could segment. go on for two hours. That's the one. Oh, yeah, now, my people, my people. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Tunnel TV. But in terms, first of all, the Iwobi matter, yes, I agree. He is he is um, got more ability than he shows sometimes. And we all agree that he has a lot of potential. And he should have, his career should have flourished a lot further than it has so far. But... Regardless of that, we're talking about today. Today, it was an Iwobi masterclass. Let, let me not front. I mean, I was fronting on him. I've used him before the game. Let me not lie. Because his performances have been underwhelming. But today, he was our man of the match. He was everywhere. Playing him in that central role seems to be working. He's a good ball carrier. I still think he needs to make better decisions with his, his range of passes. But overall, he was our best player today. And alongside Victor Osimhen as well. And me and you can maybe we talk about that guy regularly. I say I want him at the club. You say it's too expensive to bring him to Arsenal. Either way, with that being said, he's a baller. Even when he's not getting chances, he's creating his own chance. He smells that deep. Yeah, he sniffs danger. He's present every time. Present. He's just present. So it wasn't surprising that he got a, a, another goal today. He could have had a couple more, let's not lie. But he looked dangerous every time he was on the ball, man. What do you think about our performance overall today, though? Huh. Performance, not so good. The pitch was bad. The game was not exciting, but we won three points, all that matters. And on the, on the Wobi, I would say he's our best player. Probably our best player or our best player on the pitch. Today, and that says a lot about yeah, our team. The Wobi should not be our best player. <laughs> we, we deserve better. The Nigerian That's team needs to nice. grow. And the World Cup. The World Cup would have done us good because we would have built our structure. The World Cup is good to help Ghana have a better team. That's what the World Cup does. It's your best competition. Everybody wants to play the World Cup. You attract players and you build a good team. So in Ghana, not, boys, yeah, not, I, going, not going not going to the World Cup is going to set us back like five years. That's what I'm saying. Uh, well, he's right because if you look at the Italians, man, the Italians have not recovered. And yes, they have recovered. The Euro, they won the Euro. That's a recovery. But but still, they didn't make the World Cup. They didn't make the World Cup. It's, it's still in their heads. You know, yeah. you can win a tournament. It's a knockout tournament. You can have a good tournament. But when it comes down to the business, the business is making the World Cup. Now, for sure. And for, you know, for Nigeria, we've made the World Cup at least, I think, six times in our history. Mm -hmm. And 
it's 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 sad that we can't actually you know go to mental sports. Now, and to be honest, like regardless of how our team is looking. Just going to the world. Just going to the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it, you're right. It does make a massive. Yeah, we really need to start from. We need to start from the drawing board. Yeah. Our pattern of play, our transition in movement, the way we carry the ball, yeah, our formation, nothing. And I, I think, let me tell you, like I said when we were watching the game, since Wilfred and Didi has been injured in this team, we have not found that balance in midfield. It's like. There's a gaping hole there, right. and there's no organization. There's no leader pulling the strings. You know. That's the no I, I don't agree with you. If you watch this game now, don't I, say it again. No, but I don't know. No, no. He's Hold talking on. about leadership. Or... No, no, but it won't be short leadership. You're not. You're not. No, no. So, okay, okay, okay. See, wait. So I understand what you're saying. Now let, let me tell you what I understand by that leadership. It won't be was everywhere in this game. Now he, he was, was in the defense, he, he was, was in the attack, he, he, he was in the midfield. He wanted to win today. He was, yeah, yeah exactly, he wanted to win today. And, that's, and, that, and that is leadership, that is the spirit you want. You so can't be talking about overall. You can get game away game with this particular. in one game at home against a small team. Mm -hmm. When it comes down to being, to handling the main business, you meet a team that is technically as good as you, you need people like Ndidi. Why are you not going to win that game? Why are you not going to that game? You know I agree Because for me, yeah. This guy, they do well together. A table. I'm not sure what the. Well, he came on to get a yellow card. That's you know exactly. I, I feel like that guy. I feel like a table is, is, is done. That guy is a sure. poly music team. Is there wearing number seven? Bro, bro, this guy is not okay for having no, 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 no. the squad. You know, but that's, but that's experience and leadership bro. in the team. You can't tell my son, I'm not a chess woman. Can you know? I agree with that. Musa came in against Ghana the, the last eight minutes or so, to do and he got crosses in that we couldn't get throughout the whole game. Stop this thing. No, I, I watched the mad live. I saw it now. Thing, Musa got like three crosses in when he and came what in. Happened? We what couldn't cross the, the ball that day. Yeah, we lost. We lost the game. I'm saying you might need to see Musa. Nigeria, they are played at the highest level. They lost the ball twice. Scoring the World Cup. Nigerian football needs a river. Yeah, for we need to look. Forget, forget this Ahmed Musa conversation. I don't, it's a very sensitive it's topic. Because, but that conversation. what I'm trying to say is that he has achieved his caps. Let a new set of people come yes, in. Yes, now. Let us have fresh blood. But we need to be breaking our back to get Eze yeah, in. What is Ente Bosti? Eze needs to be in our squad now. But people like. The World Cup would have answered this question. Yeah. Everybody wants to go to the World Cup and do that. And Lukmao is not in this team. He's not. He's, he just came now. But you think about it, is he injured? He's not. He played today. today. Did he play? Yeah, he came, came on. Last came on. Let's see him in the game. Have you seen him in the game? Yeah, he did. He, no, he had one chance. chance. He had one chance. He got one chance. He got one chance. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he had one chance. But in terms of our gameplay today, we, like again, what I've been saying is, even though we're creating chances, I still don't know what this Pesero guy is playing. Like, <laughs> I literally don't know what our game. Like, he seems to like the four four two, which is fine. We was under Nigeria. We like, 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 football. Well, but well, 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 four four two, yeah. you can get no, 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 it. No, it, it, it was fine, but I still the no, style but, that we're playing. But, 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 is who is it four four two? I think four four two is a bad. No, I'm not saying it's bad. Yes, that is old school. If you play, everybody plays their role well, and you're scoring goals. I'm not saying it's bad. My issue is we don't. We don't have an identity for our style. What is that? We didn't play four four two. We didn't play four four two. No, we said we said four four two. Wasim and Abu up front. And Umar, Umar Sadiq. But if you think about it, maybe that's what he feels. The personnel that he has. But, but, but you see that he now take, takes out Omar Sadiq after the first half. But, anyways, <laughs> what I need to say what it about Omar Sadiq. <laughs> <laughs> it takes him an hour to get to the ball, bro. He's so slow. <laughs> like, he's, slow, slow. He's, yeah, so, but, he's a slow, he's a slow footballer. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, anyways. But we won. We won. We won. We have um you said um what's the name? We're not playing Mauritius anymore. We're we'll playing South Tome. We're playing South Tome. Tome. We'll play. <laughs> ah, they got collected. Ah, they got collected. By Guinea Bissau. Guinea Bissau. We got collected. But the thing about it is that the thing about it is that Guinea Bissau will be there five one. We go there and go and play the board performance now. No, we we'll collect. We we'll collect. Look, we'll collect. What's our style of play? What's our Nigeria? 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 What? You have to say Nigeria. Typical Nigeria win. We know how to beat small boys now. Bro, it was a typical Nigeria victory today. Day where we don't know how we play and we just end up getting three points. The it's point, typical the, of the yeah. problem is literally. Even if we're, if we're so if we're playing by so I I think playing through the middle is a very good strategy. Why? Why? Because Osime is very good on the ball. He can hold the ball. If you want so from you will be to Osime, very strong. The wing the wing play hasn't worked because you play to Calvin Cal Bassi is the one taking the crosses. Chukweze is doing Calvin Cal 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 Bassi has been taking good crosses today, and the crosses were not making sense. So, so the problem is that so how do you take a cross from one side? They know they are guaranteed a starting shirt. So they can afford to do. You see, there's no competition for places. That's the problem. We need a river. Right, right. 
right. There's no competition for I, places. I really when you know that, whether answer. you play nonsense or not, Ogan will still be me. Moses Simon is still there. All, all these players are still there. There's no competition for places. So what are we saying? Nigeria needs a revamp in football. You're right. We need a World Cup for that. That's we true. don't need a World Cup for that. That's a lie. The Netherlands, the, the Netherlands world. missed out on the World Cup twice. The revamp. You can't compare yeah. Nigeria Netherlands now. Why? Because they, they have structure. They have structure. Bro. Yes, they what have. What we have structure. What do we need structure? We need to build on structure. We need to get the right coach so we can get the structure. Where else we got? I don't know. Where else are Hosu? Where else are Hosu? Where else are Hosu? You guys, to be fair, the problem is. This coach now is not necessarily a tried and tested yes, coach. Yes, that's my issue. Closing. That's the issue. But let us give him. No, I'm giving time. him the chance. Let's give him a chance. One yeah, Roha, Roha was building. Anyways, one competitive sorry, game. Roha was building. One was building team. Three points. He contested for everything. No, no, but my point is that Roha was going to. Roha was not. No, no. But you guys Roha, wanted. Roha had some stability. You wanted. You wanted. You guys wanted us to be like. Roha almost had to be able to for Yeah, we have gone to World Cup. He qualified for everything. Because you remember when we went to the game? Bro, almost did not qualify for Afcon. Right. That boy, he qualified. Well, he qualified. He, qualified. he was he qualified. almost. He qualified for everything. Yeah. He didn't lose a single qualifier. He won. Oh, he qualified for everything. He got drawing. Yeah. He got he didn't bronze. lose a single qualifier. Yeah, my drawing. In five years. <laughs> in five years. If I don't lose a game, he got bronze at the Nations Cup. He got to the semi. He got to the semi. I'm not saying I liked him, but let me not get into something like. It's all good. We have. He was building something now. We have some too many next. It's on to the next one and. I'm sure. When is the Saturday game? I think it's coming up when next week, eh? Yeah, I think it's on the. I think it's on. Well, the, let's it's check. On the, it's on the 13th. We we'll like, definitely have something for you for that it's game. On, though, it's on the sure. 13th or the 16th of June. But um, it's it's going to be on the 13th of yes, June. Yes, on the 13th of so Monday. So it's a it's a crucial game on Monday, it's and we'll see you guys, and hopefully we will get the result again. It's Channel TV. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification button. Shout out to my handsome panel right here. You know what it is.